Rated T14. Does young people even need a voice in this community? What can the community expect from this show? Really, I am my brother's keeper. We got to be responsible for each other. It's okay to be different. Uh -huh. Building stronger communities by helping the rest of our community really make it and achieve their dreams. Ori and Georgetown counties, welcome to Sound Off. Now, Sound Off is heard weekly on your favorite radio station, and it is our goal at Sound Off to deal with topics that are relevant to not only our young people, but to the community as well. Now, unfortunately, last week we had a very special Father's Day program planned, but because of technical difficulties, we were not able to air. So, the good news is we will have a segment. The final segment of this program will be a shout out, very special shout outs to all of our fathers. And we are so honored that we were able to interview former NFL player Robert Gathers Sr. So our first two segments, we are fortunate to have with us on this morning, Mr. Robert Gathers Sr. So we ask that you would sit back, relax, and enjoy as you listen to Sound Off. Hey, hey you. Yeah, you. You on the other side of the screen. Do you want to be heard? Do you want to help your community? Do you want to make a difference? Then you should join the conversation and be a part of We Sound Off. Here we talk about topics that are relevant to the community. Log on to www.wesoundoff.com. Send us your name, age, school, and become a team member of We Sound Off. So remember, just like I, DeAndre Campbell, Tanisha, Jonica, Michelle can sound off. You can sound off too. Once again, Ori and Georgetown counties, we're celebrating real fathers, real men on this very special Father's Day weekend. And I have a very special young man with me. I consider my little brother, and I know he has a good dad. Uh, what's your name, sir? Ricky Gilliard. Ricky Gilliard. That's what I'm talking about. You're talking about uh, Pastor Gilliard's son. Now, I know you want to shout your dad out, but uh, when you get done, I want you to send out a challenge to all the men. You know, I know you're doing your thing. You got like 20 kids. and No, just kidding. I'm playing. I'm playing. You got three handsome young men and a very beautiful daughter. So I know you know what it is to be a good dad. So uh, at this time, would you like to shout your dad out? I'd love to. First, I want to send a shout out to my father, Philip Gilliard. Um, I thank you, Dad, for all of the challenges that you've provided me with over my life. I feel like if I didn't have those challenges, I wouldn't have become the man that I am and still feel that there's room for me to grow. You always taught me that the biggest room in the world is to the room for growth, and I want to continue to grow and, and show you that uh, I appreciate everything that you taught me. Um, if there was one thing that I could challenge fathers or men to do, is is just to show up. Um, my father was 17 when he had me. And I can't think of a day in my life where I felt like dad wasn't going to be there or he didn't show up. He was always there. And I think that one of the marks that fathers are missing it in on right now is the fact that we're not there. Fathers just aren't there. You know, you got to be there both to support your child and also to correct and challenge them to make sure that they're doing the things that they need to do in life. Um, there are things that you will see in your child that they may not recognize in themselves and you have to point them in that direction to help them develop the talents and gifts that God's putting in them and uh, that's, that's a father's role. So I, I challenge men to show up. I challenge you to be there for your kids. And I'm thinking about this time, um, it's funny because it's overcast outside and I was thinking about the time uh, my son, my oldest one, three years old, Gabriel, I don't have 20 kids, I only have three. I'm playing only three, only three. Yeah, um, Gabriel, uh, it was raining outside. I'd, I'd take him to the store and when we came back it was pouring rain and I had a little jacket on but he didn't. So I took my jacket off, I covered him all up in the coat, and picked him up, carried him in the house. He didn't get wet, I got soaked. Um, and when I got in the house, I just thought about how that kind of represents fathers in a lot of ways. Like a lot of times we make sacrifices so that we can cover our families. When we're going through stormy parts in our lives, we cover our families up, they don't get wet, in the meantime we're getting soaked. And so it makes our job hard. It makes it difficult, but we still gotta show up. And we got to still do it anyway. You know, wipe your face off. Stay out there. You know, a brave man likes the feel of nature on his face. So continue to press through those storms and be there for your family, man. Wow. I celebrate you, my brother. Real fathers, real men. That's my man. That's Ricky Gilliard, y'all. Now, you know, I know you said a lot of good things, but I will not allow you to leave Sound Off without shouting some other people out. Um, 
all the fathers out there, I got to shout out uh, Gary Lee and his 30 kids. Um, 35. 35 kids. Um, I definitely got to shout out all my boys since I'm on TV. I don't know if y'all going to see this, but Gabriel, Israel, and Daniel, not to mention my daughter, Aaliyah. I love you guys. I wouldn't be who I am without you. Um, I got to shout out uh, some of the just everybody, man. I love you guys. I got to shout out my wife. That's right. Yeah. Don't get in trouble. Don't get in trouble. I, I wouldn't be a father without That's right. my wife. So, yeah, I What's shot you. Name? My wife's name is Amy Christina Gilliard, a.k.a. Snuggle Bunny. I love Aww. you. I will see you later today. All right. All right. All right. Good stuff. All right. <laughs> All right. Once again, Ori and Georgetown Counties, you're listening to Sound Off, and uh, we're doing a very special edition of Sound Off. We're talking about and we're celebrating real fathers, real men for this Father's Day weekend. Of course, Father's Day is tomorrow, and uh, I have a very special young man with me on this morning. What's your name, sir? My name is Dennis McCray, Jr. Okay, Dennis McCray, Jr., and your dad, of course, must be Dennis McCray, Sr., Okay, so what makes Dennis McCray Sr. a very special dad and why you want to celebrate him this weekend? He's special because um, I like sports and when it comes to sports, he takes me around to places, gives me the equipment, gives me all the gear and all that and gets me ready for um, baseball, football, soccer, everything. Okay, so what I want you to do now is uh, send out a very special shout out to Dennis McCray Sr. All right, I want to give a shout out to my dad, Dennis McCray Sr. Happy Father's Day. Once again, Ori in Georgetown Counties, you're listening to Sound Off, and we're doing a very special edition of Sound Off. We're celebrating real fathers, real men, this Father's Day weekend, and I'm honored to have with me a very special person and a good dad, and uh, I, I would just like for you to tell the public, uh, who am I talking about? Who am I talking about right now? I'm talking about this special brother, but I need everybody to know your name. Naquan Abdul Hanif Muhammad. Okay, and Dr. Muhammad, we're doing this very special Father's Day edition because uh, I personally believe that fathers don't get enough props. And so that's the reason why we wanted to make sure that, uh, you know, the Sound Off crew, we, we celebrate dads.